हेलो फ्रेंड माय नेम इज़ प्रमोद खुडिया एंड यू आर वाचिंग माय यूट्यूब चैनल स्मार्ट इंजीनियर प्लीज़ सब्सक्राइब टू माय चैनल एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकन फॉर लेटेस्ट वीडियो इन्फॉर्मेशन टू डे वी विल टॉक अबाउट डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ सेंसर यूज इन स्मार्टफोन मैनी टाइप ऑफ सेंसर यूज इन स्मार्टफोन लाइक वेन वी रोटेट आवर स्मार्टफोन देन आवर स्मार्टफोन स्क्रीन इज ऑल्सो गोट रोटेटेड फॉर दिस काइंड ऑफ वर्क ए डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ सेंसर वर्क when we unlock our smartphone using fingerprint sensor then phone is using different kind of sensor first we understand what is smartphone sensor we can say that sensor is a different hardware and program that itself control different function in your phone a smartphone use different different kind of sensor like proximity sensor compass sensor gyroscope sensor and apsi sensor so now we briefly discuss all about the sensor different type of sensor used in smartphone like proximity sensor accelerometer sensor light ambient sensor barometer sensor gyroscope sensor fingerprint sensor so let's start the video proximity sensor this sensor make use of infrared led and ir light detector to calculate the distance between the phone display and object nearby the proximity sensor is typically used while making or attending call proximity sensor allow you to turn off your display during call when you allow your phone to make contact with your ears proximity sensor used while making call and when the phone is held to the face to make or receive a call The sensor detect it and disable the touch screen display to avoid an intended input through the skin. This proximity sensor detect the closeness of your skin and deactivated the touch screen display hence reframing your skin to make undesirable action. Accelerometer sensor. Accelerometer sensor used to measure acceleration but in smartphone they are able to detect change in orientation and tell the screen to rotate an accelerometer detect acceleration vibration and tilt to determine movement and the exact orientation along the three axes app use this smartphone sensor to determine whether your phone is portrait or landscape orientation accelerometer can also determine how fast your phone is moving in any linear direction stage ambient light sensor ambient light sensor is used when you have enable the feature of automatic brightness as the sensor detect the lighting level nearby you to adjust the display brightness accordingly it is used in automatic brightness adjuster to decrease or increase the brightness of smartphone screen based on the availability of the light ambient light sensor adjust the brightness of your smartphone according to the light coming from the outside so it is the best smartphone sensor for saving life of your battery and increase battery life gyroscope sensor gyroscope sensor work in a similar manner as an accelerometer determining the orientation detail this sensor is not only more precise then the accelerometer but it can also detect the rotation too due to its ability to determine rotation gyroscope allow apps like google sky map to determine the direction toward which our phone is pointed gyroscope sensor is also a sensor that work like a accelerometer sensors but in this sensor we can rotate screen to 360 degree The gyroscope sensor add an additional dimension to the information supplied by the accelerometer by tracking rotation or twist. An accelerometer measure linear acceleration of the momentum while a gyroscope on the other hand measure the angular rotational velocity. Next sensor is fingerprint sensor. Gone are the day of the memorizing password and pattern to unlock your phone as many user prefer using the fingerprint sensor these days. fingerprint sensor enable biometric verification to secure many smartphone today it is a capacitive scanner that record your fingerprint electrically when you put your finger on its surface the ridge in your finger print touch the surface where is the hollow between the ridge is have a slight separation 
This smartphone sensor is quite useful in app that required authentication such as mobile or Mate app. Hope you like the video. Thanks for watching my video. Like, share and comment. Don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel.